welcome everybody. So today, the house that we plan on going live to, and the place that we've been here before, that had flooded basement, it's been torn down. So what I'm going to be doing with this video is showcasing like a memory of what the house used to look like and then what the house is now looked like kind of like aftermath you know what I'm saying but they're gonna build what I believe is either an apartment complex or a new property of some sort but this house is no longer available to explore as they tear it down like most of the locations that we found and explored and all that stuff it's getting ready to be all torn down to rebuild something new which is a good thing, but we won't have that much left to explore. That's why we're trying to find new locations to find, to explore, you know? But I wanna flip the camera around, show you all around what's left of this property that was once an abandoned house. So here we go. It's kind of disappointing. Like, it really is kind of disappointing. So I was looking forward to it, you know what I'm saying? But this is all that's left. You can see where there's bulldozer that's been here to tear it down. There is the driveway. And back here is part of it too. Where the barn and stuff. But the main property of the house. I just want to come back to the back side of the house. If it's possibly some remnants of it still there, you know. But... I don't see that being still here, all of the stuff, you know, part of the house. So, but we're going to check it out for y'all. Joey's in the car. Um, I came out here to see if there's still anything left for him even to check out, you know what I'm saying? But for the looks of it, with all this mud, where is it? I think it's... Yeah, so it'll be about right about here. There's a big difference from before, because if we recall from the previous videos, it was swept right here. This is like the path to the driveway to get to the house. The garage was right there, right? House was right there. There's the pole for the house. But it's a sad day. Because it's no longer there. So I'm going to download one of my videos I made of this house. Uh, it's like a memory to add to this one, you know. Definitely got to watch out for snakes, of course. Um, I was trying to see if there's like any remnants, like debris or something like that. But you see there's like bricks. There's bricks. You know, bricks right there but it's like it's all gone like they're tearing all these places down and it's kind of upsetting in a way you know but we do have a few locations that's what I was you know saying about if they have this torn down we got a few locations to look at so yes it is completely torn down as you see uh, yeah, so it's completely torn down. Oop, I don't want to trip. But I was really looking forward to coming back here, you know. But it's a no go. It was definitely a nice house. It was easily. Whoop, I almost tripped on that. It was easily fixable, as you will see in the video, once I put these two together, you know. But there's part of the foundation there bricks as you see there but it's like man why it's got me questioning I mean I understand safety and everything but at least try to remodel it or fix it up you know it was still a beautiful home you know but I will go live at this place so that way I can explain to you all before this video is uploaded with the house that was we already filmed thankfully 
that's on the channel so we're just blessed to be even able to have that house that was still standing which is here on our channel you know what I'm saying like look it's all torn down so yeah we're gonna go live um here is the video of the house of where it used to look like from the inside out and with the flooded basement and everything like that and the paranormal activity that I had in it on the second floor so hope you all enjoyed the second video along with this one smash the like button share this out but yeah this is like a sad day for this home so this is what's gonna be turning on to right there to a factory but here's the memory of this house hope you all enjoy I am here with Joey. Hello. And we are here at this abandoned house during the daytime. We already been here at night, but now it's just Joey and I. We're going to be doing a daytime investigation first, and then we are going to be returning at night with just Joey and I to do a nighttime investigation. We are going to see what kind of activity we can get here during the day. We will have the spare talker running first while doing the walkthrough. And then after we do that, we are going to be doing some cat ball communication in each of the rooms or some of the rooms. And hopefully we can get communication through the cat balls in one of the rooms. And we might do a, a spare box session with the necrophonic. Let me know if you all hear or see anything in this video at the top of the comments. We are going to get started on this investigation. Like this video, share this video out, and let's go. We are back at that abandoned house that we just did at nighttime at 3 a.m. And we are here during the daytime. And it is just Joey Hello. and I. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna have the spirit talker running for the walkthrough and we're gonna see if the camera could pick up anything else in the house Satan Satan Oh wow, first response we got is Satan. It's blurry. It says Satan. We're gonna let the spare talker run. And we're gonna see what the camera picks up for the walkthrough. Then we're gonna do the investigation here during the day. really active at night. I like the lights. They keep secrets here. That hurts Someone's it. coming. Thought I switch out video lights. And it says someone's coming. And uh, other responses would be where.
stay. I didn't believe this. Return to darkness. They probably want us to come back here at night. Need trust. James Bill. James Butler. I think I said Bill. Bueller. And this one said Mrs. James Bill. Jane. Yeah. Oh, Jane. It says Jane. 
it, dealer. It looked like a MF. You could ask all this. Miss it. What? Yep. William uh, Bielo, he had a hot interference. Hot thing. He probably passed away, and that probably. Well, it, you got some noise up there. The probably what well, they got part the get well soon. The store has moved. This is where the majority of the activity happens. It's definitely stuffy and hot in here, yeah. Oh shit. Did you? Okay, that's so far. <laughs> Machete. Lights. Yep, that 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 was him. Cause they said he died at the hospital. 
William Hope Beeler. And that was him? Yes. But the uh, they announced it with the heart. William Beeler, yeah. William Beeler. That it, all his family don't see none as a chain though. Let's start in the second floor. Well, I want to show him the basement again. Where's the water? We will have a few cat balls in a few minutes. To, if you want to come new, take that way. Let's go back upstairs. Was that your uh, octopus uh, door frame outside? Oh, this is the boy's room. Okay. Yeah. Uh, the blue. More than likely, yeah. Nervous. It's not to be nervous about. Mm -hmm. I can, I can tell that you are probably shy, and but there's nothing to be nervous about. Can you touch one of these cat balls, please? We will appreciate it. Bertram. Bertram. You can walk one around. The spirit said that you like the lights. We got these cat balls that lights up. You light them up for us, please. Thank you. I'm over here. I hear you. 
What makes it a swerve? Can you come into this room? I'm a man. I'm a man. Are you Bertram or are you Williams or another person? I'm William. I think I just heard that to my right. Can you touch one of these cat balls to clear balls I just laid on the floor, William? Please and thank you. Whoa. I heard something in here. Haunted lighthouse warrants. Haunted lighthouse warrants. Uh -oh. Haunted lighthouse warrants. Interesting. And I heard a voice in there. Do you want to take one of those in there? Yeah. And I say. What did it say? It, it gets lonely. It gets lonely? Yeah. Okay. H-U-N-T-I-N-G. Hunting. Hmm. Do you like to hunt? The voice that I heard in here, can you line up that cat ball high lane in the middle of the floor, please? I heard you again. Can you walk towards it? It will not hurt you, I promise. I want to show you how to do it. So you walk over to it and you tap on it like that. Do you like to make noises? Can you do the exact same thing I did? So all you have to do. I promise you it will not hurt you. I'm so sorry that you have to should be scared. Why should I be scared? We're not scared.
that room looked good, but with enough pieces in this room. Yeah, I'm so sorry that you passed it at the hospital rooms. Big pet. Big pet. P A C T. A pet, not big pet. We're going to try a different room. If there's anything in here, you can go into another room with us. I grabbed the pack I'm going to put this one right away. Stand right here. Patty. Patty. I think that one in Torch. Torch. Hospital. Hospital. It's probably talking about William. Mm -hmm. But sometimes the sparrow could be stuck in one room. Dominic. Dominic. Trees. Trees. Dang, a lot of responses are coming through. Can you touch one of these cat balls we have laying here? We could probably try by uh, that hot downstairs. Yeah, that could work. We're trying to place in the cut balls by the heart. Like one on the steps because it's kind of water. Handsome. Handsome. Here. Now I was just talking about the water. One right there. One behind the door. Say right here by the heart. Were you talking about the water? That's where the necrophonic app now. Hello. Hi. 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 How you doing? D 
Do you see the crap box that I placed on the stairs and the floor? Can you turn them on, please? I promise they will not hurt you. They were a pretty color. There's nothing to be scared of. Are you all more active at night here? Charge up everything. What? We're gonna charge up everything. Right now, our demon. Mm -hmm. Said demon. Yeah. As soon as you turn that off, it's a demon. We're gonna wrap up this daytime investigation here. We're not getting no. Cap all communication during the day, but we have captured some voices here during the day, so that was good. It's more active at night from what I'm feeling, and for the daytime, it's half and half, 50 50, so I can hit or miss. Let me know what you all heard or seen in this video with the time stamp down in the comments. We're going to charge up everything like the flashlight, the video lights, and everything like that. Come back here tonight. Make sure to like this video, share this video out, and subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos. And until next time, KPE Paranormal, love and peace. Alright y'all, this has been KPE Paranormal. I just wish this house was still standing so that way I could film it once more, but unfortunately it's all gone. I hope you all like the memory of the house of when it was like up and everything like that. That way y'all can see the inside and out again. Let me know what you think about this video. Smash the like button, share this video out. Subscribe to the channel for more upcoming videos, and until next time, KPE Paranormal, love and peace.